Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome back to some Pokemon Go, and yes, we are going to be biking and teaching you guys how to actually hatch eggs and incubate them to get Pokemon out of them. Now, the reason this is a voiceover is the audio really messed up during the recording because I opened my camera. Just listen to it. Alright guys, so let's get things started. The way to go and see if you have any eggs is tap on your Pokeball and go to your Pokemon list settings. Now once you go to your settings, you can, on the top right corner of your screen, you're going to see an eggs option. If you have zero eggs, it'll show zero. If you have some eggs, then it'll show how many eggs you have. Now the thing is, to get eggs, you actually have to go to a Pokestop and spin it. Just similar to the way you get free Pokeballs, you have to just travel, go everywhere, go to your local park, go to your churches, and uh, just go to every Pokestop and just keep spinning those little, uh, I would say, token-looking things and hope that an egg comes out. Now, there are three types of eggs. There's an egg that requires two kilometers to hatch. There's an egg that requires five kilometers to hatch. And there's an egg that requires 10 kilometers to walk that, to hatch. So basically, uh, some of them hatch really easy by not walking so much. And some, you have to walk a lot to actually get them to hatch. I believe it's not confirmed that the two kilometer eggs you get candy out of. And the five kilometers and up eggs you get Pokemon out of. Now... I don't know exactly what Pokemons, I would figure 10 kilometer eggs are going to be rarer Pokemons and then the 5 kilometer eggs are the, the more common Pokemon and then the 2 kilometer eggs are actually just candy. Uh, now the two things that you can get out of uh, Pokeball, uh, Pokemon eggs or these eggs right here are obviously you can get candy or Pokemon just depending on your luck. So let's go ahead and talk about how you can incubate these and the way to incubate, incubate these eggs is having incubators and so you tap on your egg and then you tap on incubate and basically you have to have these incubators so where do I get these incubators well you can get them out of poke stops or you can buy them from the store uh, basically you just got to get lucky again you just have to go to every poke stop and hope to pull one tap on a, a incubator and tap to incubate your egg and just like that you put one of your eggs into the incubator and now is the fun part. Now is the geocaching part. You actually have to go walk and I'm on my bike. So I was on my bike and the audio messed up and I'm just gonna go ahead and take off. Now I do recommend you guys not going over 15 miles per hour on a bike because I think there's a limit uh, of, uh, of what uh, I think Pokemon does or Niantic. So if you're going over 15 miles an hour, it won't count because it thinks you're in a car. Now that is not confirmed, that is just my theory. So again, let's just recap. You can get eggs by going to Pokestops. You can get free incubators by going to Pokestops. You have to put the eggs in the incubator and actually go on a bike, jog, or anything. In, even in traffic, deadlock, just don't go faster than 15 miles an hour. Let's go back to actual live audio in a different video clip and I hope you guys live, like active cameras because I plan on buying one so you guys can see what I'm doing. Alright guys, on our biking adventure, I would say we've gone about, I would say a half kilometer and uh, let's go ahead and see exactly how longer, no I would say not even half, no we've gone a little over half, right Brooke? I think so? And, and just like that, uh, a, steady, a steady bike or maybe anything less than 10 miles per hour, I would recommend uh, counts as walking your eggs and incubating them and actually getting them to hatch. So this is a way to hatch your eggs uh, easily, which is by biking, using a hoverboard, or driving in deadlock traffic that's literally completely shut down and you're just barely moving uh, a few feet at a time. Okay guys, currently on my bike, I was on my way home, I had finished making that YouTube video explaining to you guys how to incubate and hatch your eggs. I'm actually hatching my 10, uh, the one that's uh, I think 10 kilometers, what do I do, tap on it, oh Yahtzee, Brooke, my, my, poke, my Pokemans is hatching, oh I got a pincer, I done caught like 7 of them, man, look. Alright guys, well my uh, 10 kilometer egg just hatched towards the end. I was literally ready to go home. It was over. I'm already just biking back home. And uh, I think it was that one. Let's go check it out before I'm officially finished here. Yes, it was 10 kilometers. Wow. 10 for a pincer that I had caught like 6 or 7 of them. But hey, now you know how to hatch your eggs. 
I'll see you guys next time. I'm really, really out now. <laughs>